Hello, my friends. This is Darth Paradigm. I have a uh, package from England. <clears throat> I purchased two sabers from JQ Sabers. And uh, I'm going to produce two videos. Um, there should be a stun saber in here. And there should be a, well, a little bit of a surprise. Yeah, another uh, NeoPixel for the collection from a, a very, very, very uh, reputable source. And uh, this thing is very heavy, so I'm not exactly sure what's going on inside the package. Please note, uh, we've got a little bit of the standard DHL, uh, standard issue damage to the box. So that's that's just fine. That's pretty much SOP. Uh, you probably have all received sabers and much the same condition. Uh, we uh, don't really take too much care with uh, with our stuff, do they? Uh, so anyway, let's see if I can get this thing open without doxing myself. I'm just gonna open one end and I'm just gonna shred it. Uh, or at least I'm gonna try to. some leverage I can actually do what I'm planning on doing there we go no fuss no muss so what do we have first well uh, I'm thinking this is a neopixel blade what else do we have we have a charger all right Possibly be one of the hilts. A lot of uh, well, the content of this package kind of slid out. Boy, this is a mess. There's all kinds of stuff in here. Yeah. All right. And uh, a little package with no doubt with receipts and a little card for JQ Sabers. Um, hmm. I think the hilt was kind of in here and it sort of slid out. And I'm getting like little shredded things everywhere. And aha! All right, so this is the stun saver. So I'll show that off first. And that is uh, what this video is going to be about. And then we'll do the other <coughs> hilt which uh, will probably be far more spectacular and interesting to, for you guys than I think this one probably will be. Anyway, so we don't need the NeoPixel blade. And yeah, we don't really need the charger and the card. And yeah, there. All right, so I uh, initially had seen this hilt and it was something that I hadn't really seen from uh, from JQ Sabers before. And as I said, it's just a stun saber, but um, it has a purple LED. And uh, they've got stuff in there to protect the uh, to protect the LEDs. Now I don't know if this is a tri crease setup or a quad crease setup. It looks like it could possibly be a quad crease. I kind of have to flash up. Well, I would have to turn it on and then maybe we'll get some kind of idea. But yeah, as I said, it was uh, just a health that I've never seen from uh, JQ Sabres before. And um, I don't know, it looked like it'd be pretty comfortable. It wasn't very expensive. So I figured, why not? So here, got a nice little angled emitter. I thought there'd be a little bit more curvature to the hilt, but apparently there is not. Uh, the switch, as far as I know, is a backlit switch. has a recharge port back here, which is quite lovely. So I'm assuming it has a lithium-ion 18650 battery. Now let's see if this thing turns on. Is it just my push the button? Yes. Now, um, I can't really tell. 
might be just kind of like a skillet LED setup. Fortunately, I don't have a blade to put in here right now, but um, it's working. It's just kind of a white backlit switch. It's not momentary or anything. It's just a, a latching switch. But um, yeah, so initial impressions. Looks like it's pretty comfortable single-handed. It takes a one-inch blade. So I'll probably do a, a, a bit of a nighttime LED display on this thing and see if I can find out more about the LED that's in here. But uh hilt's long enough, so you can wield it two-handed. It's not quite, quite long enough, but it'll suffice. Has nice little grippy points here and here, a little choke point. Yeah, this is a solid piece. I'm gonna try to find out more about this uh, hilt. I'm I'm assuming this is just a a new style of hilt that JQ Sabers is going to be uh, offering, and I would assume that they're probably going to be doing uh, installs that you know maybe have sound like Pico Crumble or something to that effect, or maybe this is just going to be their new version of um I forgot what they call it um they uh. They've been offering stunt sabers for a few years now, and I forget what they're called. And it's like one's called the Caliber, and uh, they offer, you know, yeah, I can't remember, but uh, this might be just the, the new version of what they're going to offer for standard uh, stunt saber. But then again, that's all speculation. So, anyway, so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. So, there you go. There's my uh, my new stunt saber from JQ Sabers, and um, there'll be more on this later. Yeah. Very nice, very solid piece. It's very, very well made. Yeah. Got your uh, LED retention screw. This probably holds the chassis in place right here. So, um, yeah, very, very high quality, which is uh, pretty much what I was looking for. All right, cool. So, anyway, uh, that's video number one, and video number two will be coming up very shortly. So, I hope you enjoyed this video, and um, I will see you again in just a little bit. Thank you for watching and take care now. Bye.